to it. Right then, so um, you watched the interview on Ricky Gervais yep. uh, on Absolute Radio. Um, so my first question for you is, what kind of question types were used in this interview? Um, well, a lot of the question types were open questions, Yeah. because um, the questions were not just about one specific thing, so it couldn't be like a yes or no answer. Because yeah, so you had to elaborate on it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so Ricky then answered with um, a lot of detail and elaborate answers. Um, what type of interview do you think this was? Was it sort of a hard news? Was it light-hearted? I thought it was a light-hearted and yeah. comical um, Why is that? news. Because um, it was like a conversation yeah. um, between them. It wasn't like someone being interrogated or yeah. being um, having like very serious formal questions targeted at them. It was very kind of like a bit of conversation, just like kind of two friends talking, it sounded like. Yeah. And you could also see from their body language, you, because it was the radio interview was also filmed, that they were leaning into the conversation and they were um, showing that they were both interested from their body language. Yeah. Um, so yeah, on the, on the subject of that, how did the body language of the interviewer and interviewee reflect about how they felt about each other? Um, like I just said, um, they were making eye contact with each other and they were leaning in and they weren't sat back kind of like that. Yeah. Um, not, um, they were engaging because they were, um, talking at each other and looking at each other and... And they're friends as well, they already know each other, so... Yeah, and you could tell that else. definitely from their body language, yeah. by just the way they were sitting and acting. Um, so, what about the topics? Uh, you know Ricky talking about what he's been up to and stuff. Yeah, um, talking about doing his stand-up and uh, how he does it for a career and how he enjoys it and the... Um, the questions he was being asked were very open, so it was like, um, kind of, how do you find doing stand-up as a career with the audience? That was one of the questions, I think. And, yeah, yeah, it was. Um, that question was very open, so it wasn't a closed question. So um, he could just tell some stories about it just from that one question, and then they had a lot of kind of sub-questions from that, um, yeah. and it was more like a conversation rather than his question, his a blunt answer. It was very um, detailed and in-depth, like a conversation. Yeah. Um, so, were they listening actively? Yes, or? very, because um, there wouldn't be pauses between um, when they answered the questions. Yeah. Um, and Ricky Gervais knew a lot about the topic he was talking about, so he was able to answer quickly and. It just showed how they were both engaging as well because as soon as one person said the other one, they were quick to respond. Oh, yeah. Um, and last of all, how do you feel the interview was structured? I mean, did it all fit in with what was being said? And yeah, because they kind of had, although the, the whole thing was very light-hearted, um, they kind of had more, <laughs> more uh, kind of serious questions um, to kind of kick off, but then they kind of went into more conversational questions and uh, funny questions, Yeah. so um, you kind of got eased into the interview well. Yeah. Alright, cool. Well, thanks for joining me, Hamish Campbell. My pleasure. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what are you giving birth?